house and we're gonna work on his SR coupe today and what are we doing Nick we're, well first of all you got greasy garage a greasy garage this, this, is, <laughs> this is the new name of the new house okay and we're going to hook up an oil pressure sensor well an oil pressure gauge I've already got all the port and everything connected when I bought the engine it had it but all this crap was you want to hold the flashlight up. yeah light me up buddy Okay, just tell me where. Okay, it's dark and it's cold outside, so. This is how I like to do things. They're yeah. really inconvenient times and ah, just, that's that's the way life works for me. Sorry. What's up guys? This is a uh, greasy garage. Greasy garage. So, uh, you know, this oh, is yeah. my disassembled notch top S14 engine. Um, the block's actually at the machine shop. Got the manifold down there, fresh welded diff. And more stuff. Caps over there. You know, all kinds of shit. 30 seconds into the video and we already lost a fitting we need. <laughs> no, we lost the little flare for the Okay, fitting. flare for the fitting. A1. This is actually very uncommon to have happen. In Greasy Garage. Yeah. Day one of Greasy Garage and we're already fucking up. Oh, it's right here. You're kidding me. Look at that. There we go. Okay, All we right. didn't lose it. We lied. It's just hard to see. As you can tell, it's a very, very small piece. So, not yeah. that easy to spot. Yeah, okay. There we go. All right. Found that shit. Like I said, we got to swap out. You're going to use copper instead. This is a bit longer, as you can see. That plastic's not very long, so. Probably hold this a better work. accurate reading. I do know. also have... Hose. I'm gonna put this through a piece of rubber hose to help protect it. Be smart, guys. Oh, okay. Yeah, I thought you were just going bare copper. No. So. Never uh, mind. Yeah, we come a little bit prepared over here. They said this isn't necessarily the first car we've done. As you can see right there, there's a drawer full of hose. You know. <laughs> Damn! Sizes. And you fucking hacked my radiator hose the other day? <laughs> <laughs> I, I told you. I told you. I didn't have to fucking hack it. I have hose. Yeah. That head's gonna get some big cams. We won't talk about that yet. No. We'll save that for when we're building it. We will save that for later. Fucking camera's like all wonky. Here's the cars at the racetrack. Okay, I'm gonna try to film and do this. Okay, so it's just going. It's just going. Okay. So, copper wires in, and that Nick's over there fucking dicking with it on the other side of the engine. So, I gotta find a spot for this flashlight, which there's no spots available, so. Perfect. Not really. This sucks. Perfect. Okay. So all of his gauges are falling out. Alright. I'm like struggling with light and gauge here. Is this even threading on? Huh? It's like, couldn't tell if it's even threading on. Should be. Do those ones do the same thing or no? No, kinda... that one, these ones don't thread on, just that one. I think that's straight. On the bottom of the top, what do you prefer? Whatever way it goes in is what I prefer. That's why I said I told you it fits snug, snug in there. I don't know if someone bought it to fit, or made to fit, or what they did, but it fits when it fits. Probably that midsection on the top, or actually get this corner right here.
I mean, if it doesn't pop out. <laughs> We're, we're chilling. Yeah, it's it's cool. it is chilly out here. Make sure you guys stay warm. Right. Working on your stuff. Get in the garages if you can, as you can we're tell. We're kind of. I have another car in the way of my garage, and obviously my garage is very full. Yeah. Um, I used to have a two car garage, so I kind of, I had to downsize, but I'm looking to buy a house, you know, within about a year or so. Sometimes you sacrifice. Make them sacrifices, guys, do it. Make your old lady happy. <laughs> if you want to succeed, you got to risk it all, man. Sometimes you do. Oh, fuck it. Don't think it. Oh, yeah, there you go. That's a nice port. Uh -huh. Is it going on easy? Mm -hmm. Pretty much. So I'm trying to just keep it straight. And it's going to that one port down... I'm gonna go in there a ways. That port right there, that's kind of cut off. Over here, it's robbing your light to show everybody. Damn, son, you need a new hood stat. Well, the new hood's on the hatch. I have a new hood on the other car, or a nicer hood on the other car. We just gotta get her on there. It's okay, mine looks like it went through a fire. Which it probably did, knowing who I got it from. Yeah. Flashlight. It's in the car. I think. Okay. It's on the. Um, I just need to check and make sure I have most of this line through here, so I have enough of it to reach down in there. I th yeah. Um, I think you have a little. I, I think you have a little now. bit more in there. Well, I've been pulling it some too. So. I think that only gained like three inches. All right, three inches is it. You only need four to penetrate, so we ain't, we ain't going. I really don't even need that, but if you don't even have that, <laughs> I highly suggest uh, some surgery. figuring something out. I, I don't know what to tell you in that situation. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we just did all that work to find out where we were running to was a coolant port so we're just gonna put it all back together and see if it starts because it, it was a little start. leaky well it should start but we found a hose wasn't tight tightened down all the way might have vibrated loose too it's it's possible but at the same time I was kind of in a hurry because I was in the middle of moving on the literally the final steps of putting this car together Here. Boost leaks, just SR things. Uh, I don't. So, well, I was more worried about my wastegate being plugged in. Oh, yeah. You don't want to run a wastegate off atmospheric pressure. <laughs> Unlimited boost. <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've been there and done that. Max do out. Do not do that. I... Okay. Well, a little warning we always have a cold start problem. This thing never wants to start when it's cold but once it starts and warms up a little bit it runs like a fucking dream Brr. fucking cold Sad. Sad. Oh, there it goes. Might be your plugs, dude. Could be like a little old. Could be plugs. Could be a bad sensor. Nighttime wiring. Hell yeah. 
Oh, dude, I actually got some stickers here at the anime show. Um, they were selling some initial D ones there. No shit. I got a fucking I got a Night Kid one oh, and a. Oh, I forgot like, that's know. that's uh. It's um, like animated. Or yeah, I got a. It's from Japan. Yeah. I got a Night Kid and an Akina. They were selling Emperor and uh, Red Suns there too. I don't know which one I'm gonna put on like fucking 240. Maybe Night Kids. So like, favorite, share, and subscribe. Always more videos to come. Now I'm working with Nick, finally. So we're gonna be doing a build series on his coop and his him building his block. Oh, his his uh, notch top. His block. His notch top. It's arcing off something now. I don't know the, where, but it just did it. Yellow's arcing off. I think off it did block. off that bolt. We're gonna yeah. move that real quick. Be careful for that, guys. <laughs> we're over here. Just said in the dark. <laughs> get it, get her done. Anyways, I'm freezing, so I'm gonna close this video out. Cause you know. So, bye guys. Later.